How to make a mask whip effect. Trim your clip in the part where you want the effect to be. Duplicate this part and leave it in the side for now. Select your middle clip, make it a new fusion clip, and go to the fusion page. Add a transform node, change the edges to warp. This way the image is repeating when you move it. Go in the first frame, add a keyframe, go in the last frame and move the image to the side to repeat it as many times you like, but place the last copy in the same position. Go in the settings tab and check the motion blur, increase the quality and shutter angle. Add a directional blur, increase the length, and you are ready to go in the edit page. Now that you made the slide part, bring over the copy you've made. With this copy selected, open the color page. Go in the magic mask tab. Activate the toggle mask overlay, to be able to check your mask. Draw a line to your subject, and change the quality to better, because obviously it is better. Increase the radius and the blur amount to finesse the mask. When you are satisfied, hit the play button and leave the AI demon do the work for you. One eternity later. When it's done, right click in the nodes window, add an alpha, output, and connect the blue dot on it. Go back to the edit page, and your effect is ready. You can add a short transition in the background clips just to blend things better. I will use a brightness flash transition, but you can experiment with anything. If you liked this video, subscribe to this channel. If you didn't, you've just wasted your time.